Are we all on board? Are we ready? Someone sitting here on me? No. Okay. <laughs> Tyson, you ready? Yeah. I'm ready. Ready when you guys are. To your left over here. Stand down, everyone. Just one minute. Keep an eye on him. All right. Fire away. I wanted to start with asking you about going softball in the second round. What was your thought process by switching uh, to the softball after you spent the first round? Four shots. I'm the extras. I can go softball or the left as well as the right. Um, I wanted to show a few things to the American public to introduce myself properly. Um, tonight I showed a little bit of speed, boxing skill, and my ability to slip and slide in the way of punches, and also the ability to finish, which is important. How, how different did it feel having been in a regular rhythm? You fought in December and now you're back, so you didn't have that long layoff. Did you feel that made a difference? I'm more active now than I've ever been in the full career, apart from the first year. This is Tyson Fury, he's most active. And you know, I always wanted to stay active in the career. Um, and I finally get the opportunity to do that. I believe I'm out again in another few months, so I'm looking forward to that fight as well. Next question. I've got something about Davis and uh, Tyson Fury's channel. Go on, Russell. <laughs> Thank you, Tyson. Um, just let's get a quick chat with you, Ben. And you know, Tyson, Showed his boxing skills, showed his evasiveness on the ropes, hurt another opponent, finished him, had the towel thrown in, did it in two rounds, sang a lullaby to his wife after, but you told me you weren't that happy with the performance. Why? No, not that happy. What I said is I'm a perfectionist, so I'm always looking at what way we can improve. Um, and obviously I'm happy with the performance, but it's my job to look at where we can improve. If I was just happy with everything, then there wouldn't be no improvement. So. That's, uh, that's my job to, to do that. Is that why you're a good team? 100 percent. You can pen mine to lock mine off and down. <laughs> Dream team. Hey guys, congratulations. You were in the USA colors going out to the in America. I know you really fought a couple times before with Cunningham Wilder. Do you feel like this is really your entrance and your first time in front of Black Bulls Ice here in America? I thought that this was my coming out party. Um, the, the, you saw me fight in December of last year. Um, I had to lose 147 pounds for that fight, so it wasn't that the strongest or maybe I shouldn't have took that fight as soon as I did after the two bomb fights on the fight, but I did it anyway, so we're not here to talk about the past. This time, I had enough training time, I was strong, I was fit, I was ready to put on a show. Um, the ring walk to all week publicity. I felt calm and relaxed and you know, confident in my own ability. We worked very hard for this fight. I trained in training camp for eight weeks and then I came into the camp fit anyway, but I had no time off, so I'm active, you know, and I'm getting match fit again. I'm looking forward to the next fight. Are you basically now planting your flag in the United States and fighting here for the foreseeable future with our UK fights? Um, I think my next few fights are definitely going to be in America. Um, probably Frank will tell you more about the DJ because I'm not. Uh, 100% on what's going on next and then we're fighting next. But yeah, I think the foreseeable future is uh, USA for sure. And when did you get the inspiration to come out in that Rocky IV kind of entrance? You know, I thought to myself, no one's done this before. So I wanted to put on a statement on a show and I wanted to have fun. I didn't come here to just be deadly serious and and have a fight with somebody because nobody's really interested in that. It's another boxing match, isn't it? We've seen a thousand before, and I'm sure we've seen another million throughout history. But it's the character, it's things people don't do. I don't take myself that seriously, as you can tell. I'm not just a, a chubby guy who comes and has fun, I'm relaxed, I don't care about fighting, it's spread naturally what I do. Um, it, it's fun and games for me. Now. And I enjoy the ring walk, I enjoy the build up, I enjoy the whole week, and I enjoy the fight. But like Ben said, it wasn't punch perfect, although it was a good performance. I still got hit with one punch, which is one too many, in my opinion. And uh, 
Ross, 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 so we're going to go back and train and get back in the gym as soon as we get back Tuesday. So no time off for you all day, sir.